Welcome to Everyday Happiness, where we create lasting happiness in two minutes a day through my signature method of intentional margins, creating harmony between your to-dos and your priorities, happiness science, and musings about life. I'm your host, Katie Jeffcoat, and in episode 107, we talked about this idea that thoughts create our unhappiness, not our circumstances. Some people think this might be one of life's uh, greatest secrets, right? Because it seems like the opposite is true. If we could just get our circumstances to change, we would finally be happy. Well, I want to introduce you to my dear friend, Amy. She's an active and healthy mom of two young boys and a wife to her wonderful husband. And over a year ago now, she was diagnosed with an aggressive form of breast cancer. Her circumstances went from good to terrible, terrible. But her mindset didn't, at least not most of the time. She decided that she would keep a high vibe, as she would say, and be intentional about carving out time to nurture her body and her mind during what is turning out to be a list of unfortunate circumstances. The mindset, this mindset has allowed her to be present in the moment of the good things that are happening and that do make her happy. Sometimes her happiness is a green smoothie and other times it looks like a long hike with her family or a trip to the beach with her sister. She's present. She's feeling the sand in her toes and quite possibly every single grain of sand. She's in a really tough spot. She's not Pollyanna about it. She's just choosing to not get caught up in the circumstances. Since Amy's diagnosis, the chemo has been longer, the side effects have been stronger, the fatigue has been all consuming. But she's intentionally caring for her mindset, which is allowing her to be happy even when her circumstances totally suck. As some people would say, she's looking on the bright side. I wanted to share Amy's story of strength and resilience, really, as an example of how we get to choose how we show up and how powerful the mind is, even when circumstances totally suck. She's a beautiful reminder to me every day, and I hope that her story will inspire you to find that silver lining in the midst of your circumstances and perhaps even experience some happiness. And if you enjoyed this episode of Everyday Happiness, make sure that you hit that subscribe button wherever you are tuning into today so that you never miss an episode.